Oh my god. Um, Nevada Pass is a non-profit organization that helps families who have children with disabilities. PEP stands for Parents Encouraging Parents. Changing the world one person at a time. That's what Nevada PEP means to me. Oh, it's wonderful. We're a family of families, I like to call it. And it's just, um, and all of us have passion for individuals with disabilities. And that's what we do. Well, what really impressed me with Nevada Pet is the fact that um, two women started it in 1995 out of their garage, period. That, that is the story. Yeah, I was here from the beginning and um, I've been advocating for my son when he was very young and I needed more help and I ran into Karen Teacher and uh, and the partnership forms. We were a support group first and then a PTI. Everybody here has a child with a disability or, or a relative has a disability or have a disability themselves so we understand pretty much what parents have gone through just because we've lived through some of those same experiences. I am a family member of a child with a disability and I have that passion to really help families and find the resources in their community that they need. Well, my son has a disability. My son has autism and um, Nevada Pep has helped me in my journey with my son and understanding my rights and helping me to become a stronger advocate. So I started about a year ago volunteering. <laughs> well, I have a family member with a disability, and then I, I started doing ABA therapy for students with autism and, and have been active in working with uh, people with disabilities. I have a son with uh, Down Syndrome, and um, he's eight years old. So now he's part of Part B Services, which is what PEP um, is involved with. We're involved with Part B Services of the law. Um, basically, I'm here to help families navigate through the system, just like somebody helped me. Well, uh, Miguel was diagnosed with autism. He was about three years old, and we really didn't know where to go. We didn't know what to turn, and I mean, he wasn't, you know, he wasn't communicating with us. He didn't know how to speak or anything, and the only way that he would actually communicate with us was, would be, like, um, through pointing, or he would just cry until, um, until we started taking him to school and we got an advocate from PEP that, that was helping us through the process and, and she kind of guided us through what our rights were, what we were entitled to in the school district um, and, and how, to help, how to best help Miguel. I came to PEP because uh, my youngest son has autism and Diane is my advocate and there was a job opening so here I am. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I have a son with autism. He's 25 years old, and I've been involved with PEP for over 10 years. And being a mom of a child with a disability, I understand what parents go through, so I wanted to help other families. My child has a disability, and we're having a hard time getting um, accommodations in place for her to succeed in school. So, so we came here, got help. Volunteered, now I work here. Looking at ways to teach the family how to work called math and life a learning opportunity. Kind of, we kind of call it the front lines. When a, when a family first calls, I take that phone call and um, just sometimes what they call they're really frustrated. They don't know. They don't. They they've tried other other places they don't know what to do and we try to provide that support to them let them know we are here to help you we are here to assist you in any way that we can and we know that you are not alone you know, I just spent two hours with a family dad came in completely despondent not knowing what to do and left like okay I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do this you know that made my day. That made my day. And I really believe that Dad's going to go do this, this, and this, and his children are going to be benefiting. Oh, we can do is keep 
when you have a child with a disability and you know that they are doing good in school, they're being successful, they're making progress, as a parent and as an employee of someone out in the community, you can focus more on your job, you can focus more on being a better employee if you know that your child is safe and being successful in school. So Nevada Pep helps families out in the community and in turn makes them better employees for community business leaders. So we're looking for the community leaders to support Pep and donate to Nevada Pep. And you can donate online on our website at www.nvpep.org or you can call and I can give you more information. We can, we can, we can help you.